Alright, what is going on? Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Game of Freak 1000, and today we're going to be doing a playthrough of Life is Strange. I've never ever heard a thing about this, I've only heard this on Jeff's channel. I heard it was a really cool game, really big decision making, and I really enjoy decision making games. So we're going to see, you know, what, what this is all about. I have no idea what this is about, so I hope you guys enjoy. I don't know how long this video is going to be. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's like each episode, but I'm not entirely sure, so... Uh, bear with me, I don't know what's going on, so we're gonna play it. So, Life is Strange is a story game that uh, features player choice. The consequences of your in-game actions decision will, you know, encounter your future happenings. Okay. Stormy. Says who? I hope. Please let me make it there. Okay. Wow. Um, oh, whoops. That's the wrong one. So. Seems that she's lost. Not knowing where she is. It is raining. Great observation, Ken. Good job. 10 out of 10. The art in this game is really interesting, though. Definitely. Can I sprint? I'm what the hell? She has to be dreaming. Or just taking some fat LSD hits. Oh shit, that's a torpedo. What the fuck? Torpedo, tornado, I don't know. One of those. Can we like sit on the bench and just chill, watch it? Holy shit. Holy fuck. Oh, oh yeah, I'll be safe at the lighthouse. That was so yep. surreal. I knew she was dreaming. Of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now... Can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arvis. There Woo! you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Excuse me. And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? Oh. What if Arvis chose to capture people at the height? Look at this crap. Oh, I see. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. I think that's kind of a cool picture. I'd... Of their beauty or innocence. She had a brilliant eye. I can take a selfie. Let's do it. But first, admit, I'm not a big fan let of me take a selfie. I prefer Robert. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a oh god, a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. Class is gonna laugh. The class is gonna laugh at me. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please 
tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self portraits. I, I did know you're asking me. Oh shit. You're asking me? The fuck? How should I know who invented the selfie? You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here? Chill the fuck out, stuff? dude! Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sucking. Wow! Good for you, bitch! Good, Victoria. Fuck you. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces. Making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. Fuck some my pencil case. Can I get a pencil and just stab this Robert bitch? Cornelius. You can find out all about. I can't about believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. School's out, motherfucker. Guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Melissa. That guy's a prick, man. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too, and yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. I thought he was a nice guy. Like his glasses look nice, his personality traits and stuff are nice, but then etched marks. Yes, Victoria. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. You're submitting your photo for the competition. Everybody in class is turning in a photo, so you see the dilemma. I know, Mr. Jefferson. Wow. I just needed to capture it. Can I take a picture of her booty? She's got a picture of her buddy. Her good old booty. And I want to represent Blackwell Academy. You have just by part Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking so Oh my god, my life's so hard. This is just a bump on a bigger road. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Yeah, okay. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Oh, I think I picked the wrong one again. You're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. So, can I leave then? Is that all you wanted? Yeah? Okay, bye. Peace out. Good knowing you. Good seeing you. Later. You Bitch. Didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I'm not paying you you always Welcome to the real world. That bitch in the background was talking about nudes. Fuck. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total. Splash water. If you know what I'm saying. I'm a fucking pervert. That that is literally me at school. I'm like, fuck everything. Headphones on. Fuck you all. Go away. Some jam. Jamming out. Ba ba da ba ba ba. Oh, swag fag alert. <laughs> you fucking swag fag. Kill yourself. Walker. Wow. Hello, Jack. Kiss, kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous as usual. This is dramatic as fuck. Oh my god, I like this. Dude, why? Hey, hey, stop it. I hate holy jocks. Why, why can't I just fuck him up, man? What a bitch. Picking on that kid. Samuel, bitch ass. Okay, we're not going out that door. That's awkward. Uh, I 
Are we going home? Maybe? No? I, I don't want to, like, you know, accidentally drag us on. Left mouse button to go to the main campus. I need to go splash some water on my Oh! Right! Bathroom! I have to go take a shit! Gotcha! <sighs> There's a sprint button in this game. Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. It's not a good way to think. Please don't have a meltdown. <laughs> now who would bother to write I would crap? bother to write that crap. Like, how, is she a bitch? I mean, if she's a bitch, then yeah. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. No! What the fuck? Dude. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Butterfly. Butterfly. Now kill that bitch. Kill the butterfly. What? It's cool, Nathan. Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just. If he gets free. a gun. He's in it. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I want it, I could blow it up. You're the boss. What the f So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck oh, I am. Shit. Who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! No, don't come out, man! What are you doing? What the fuck? Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that She's be? She's still... I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. Fuck. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. Yeah, she likely was. These pieces of time can frame us in our I already world. heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color to Now shadow. Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit! Can you give me an example of a Man, photographer? I cannot believe this. Captured the human condition in black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy. Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller, Diane, Can I actually reverse time? Victoria, why Arvis? Because of Victoria, why Arvis? Because of her images of hopeless. Arvis. There you go, Victoria. What the fuck? Why Arvis? This is so cool. Because of her images of hopeless faces, you feel like totally haunted. Oh. I'm stupid as fuck. Okay, gotcha. I did it. Can you I actually did it. A photographer who perfectly I'm captured the time machine. And Anybody? Max, 
Don't freak out. Not yet. Taking another selfie. Let's do it. When I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming this. It's real. I can tell. So I can go back in time. Selfie expression. What if that girl isn't dead yet? Oh. always been a vital aspect of art and photography. I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please? Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. I know it this time, man. I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? Nice try, Max. No. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me Who's after class. And I need time to save that girl. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck oh, in my program. fuck you, bitch. Correcting me again. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again and give him the right answer? Okay. Max, since you've oh, yeah. our interesting no mistakes. conversation, can you please... Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. Oh, yeah. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular. Mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of Okay, that. let's get out. Let's go save this bitch. Guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Why would I pretend not to see you? You, I just answered you right. We're, We're all friends now. It's time to be an everyday Hell. hero. But okay, let's go. Yes, Victoria, you still have to be your own. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about. Seriously, you. like I have people to save. I don't have time for this. I'd never let one of photography's future stars okay. avoid. Okay, we know what happened. Uh, not sure if I have one. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure I have one. Given your selfie output, I'm sure you must have about a thousand pics by now. It'll take a long time to find a good one. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Oh, dang. All right, can I go? go Thank you. Don't let me stop you. Let's go save her. I don't, I don't want to, maybe I don't want to, oh, fuck, yes, by a mark on the gauge, I don't know what I'm doing, guys, I'm sorry. Even if you're submitting your photo Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Oh, Excuse fuck you, you bitch. No, Victoria, Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing it. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy oh, yeah. making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. Okay. Thank you. Ma motherfucking can't say that word. Alright, let's go save her. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please. Just what please. way is the bathroom? I can't tell anybody. Oh no, I don't want to rewind! <laughs> Go away, you swag fag. And he's getting bullied again. Yo, Daniel. 
You remember that it's payday? Okay. Bathroom. Butterfly is gonna come in before I even get to the person, but Okay, Max, retrace every step. Okay. So uh wash my face. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Oh shit, okay. I'm ready. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where did you get that? What are you doing? Come oh on, god, no, I don't want to walk out. Firebell. It's happening again. I need a hammer to break Son of a bitch. Oh my god. This is just. Oh! Grab it! No! No, 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 no! If I can reverse time again, I can help her. Can I? I'm. Show me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. No, he has a gun. I should do something else. Okay, I'm gonna rewind so I can actually. Like, right to the beginning. Okay. Tell me, you. I'm so. Okay, cool. Grab the fucking hammer. Oh, I already have a hammer. Bang! Come on! No way! Don't ever touch me again! Holy shit! Another shitty day. That did not happen. This cannot be real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Fuck's your oh. problem. Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. All right, every. <clears throat> All right, everybody, I hope you guys really enjoyed that video. This was a really interesting game so far that I have played. I really like the idea and the, like, you know, ideas and scenarios are really cool so far. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be everything for today's video. Leave a like if you enjoyed this and tell me down below if I should do it again. Uh, I want to make a series out of this, and uh, it's, it's a more intriguing Let's Play. So I hope you guys have a fantastic day, evening, night. I don't give a shit. Have a fantastic day in general. I'll talk to, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.